Okay, this feels so weird talking to a camera like this in English because I'm a Spanish but I want to talk in English so there you go Hi <laughs> What we're going to do today, I'm going to show you my sketchbook that I'm currently using. It's not finished yet, but almost finished. And there's so many things that I loved about this sketchbook and I want to show you. So, okay, so I'm a mess basically because I forgot to introduce myself here. Uh, so, yeah, to make it sure, I am Lucia, also known as Tammy in social media, Instagram and Twitter. Um, I'm an illustrator and artist from Spain, Andalusia, like is in the south of Spain. Um, yeah, I'm currently doing a master in illustration. Um, yeah, that's it. And now, now we are going to start the video. Um, I'm going to show you my sketchbook and hope you like it. Okay, so I forgot to recall myself talking while showing you the sketchbook so this is going to be a voice over with the amazing sound of my laptop dying inside mm, yeah i have to buy a new one those are the locations that i draw uh, mostly here in spain and portugal the first ones were from 2021 like two years ago uh yeah it's been a few years since i started it but I don't know, I'm taking my time. Those are some drawings that I made on Intiglana two years ago in summer. I went with my family. It was like a family trip and we spent a whole week together in a house with a swimming pool and it was really cool. I also made some studies from Narnia, from places that I've been to, like there was some kind of garden or forest near my uncle's house some details of the garden of my uncle's garden or the street like or even a cup of coffee you can see there i don't know these like really small details i went to the um, sushi pan is like a, res a sushi restaurant with my friends and i'm currently obsessed with mm, white wine i also love to draw in coffee shops like ah, is my hobby go into new coffee shops and draw what i have in front of me those drawings are when i went to portugal with my, with my friends in 2021 you can see i think it was, it was october yeah uh so yeah all of us wrote a sketchbook and we were drawing everywhere we go and it was cool when we finished the trip so all our drawings together it was really different but at the same time we were at the same place and i don't know it was really cool i in this one i went to seville to celebrate my friend's birthday with him and those are just studies from for me in seville Cadiz, different locations this from Seville, I think. Yeah, it's the same coffee shop as before. Um, yeah, when I went to Portugal, I fell in love with the um, architecture, as you can see, and even the old houses with the broken rooftops. That I don't know, it was such a mix of nature and how I mean, life, life, yeah, like. It was random, but I don't know, it was really enchanting for me. And I spent a lot of time drawing what I was saying there. I don't know, I really liked it. Oh, this was the first time that I went to Granada last year <laughs> looking for uh, flats. Like, uh, <laughs> because this year I'm studying here, so I went with my friend and flatmate right now to look for somewhere to leave <laughs> oh we found it in the first day oh this one it was in the um, coffee shop unicorn coffee shop is called and i went with some classmates this is i have to continue it this is a building that i saw here in granada um i actually drew draw it a few times in different uh, medias 
oh and this one i made it while we were having a mat master class of watercolor and ink in class um i went also with my friend erica to some gardens here in, here in granada to spend their day and we were drawing and the weather was awesome it was sunny and warm i don't know i think granada has a lot of beautiful places that i'm discovering every day last yesterday i think yeah yesterday i went to have a mental health walk with me with myself and i ended up in a beautiful garden like it was really big and beautiful garden and i don't know the um, the hour already changed so it was like 8 30 and it was still sunny so i, I was uh, i loved it i could see the sunset in the garden and i loved it it was a, such a really nice afternoon I'm going to show you what are the tools that I use mostly on the sketchbook and these are all the ones that I have always, always with me but these two are the main ones that I use um, this is a big graphic one and this is a, a pile to one 0 0.5 this one works with watercolors and this one doesn't I hope this will work with but no let me show you an example better so you can understand what i'm talking about okay so i am going to use this block that i have it's a council but mixed media paper it stays okay this one stays it doesn't move they and in this one uh, this happens <laughs> you know what I mean okay as you can see I changed my t-shirt but just because I wanted to show you one of my favorite t-shirts ever and that my friend and classmate Julia made it I'm going to leave her Instagram here but look at this look at this like I'm currently obsessed <sighs> Julia thank you <laughs> Come on, look at this, it's a cat with boots! Okay, and that was the video until now, yeah. Hope you like it, if you like it, give like, subscribe, whatever we usually say in these kind of videos. If you want me to do any kind of videos in the future, just put it on the comments below, because I'm quite curious of what you want to see from my life. If you want me to do like a day with me or a week with me, okay perfect maybe another sketchbook tour or paint with me or draw with me like the uh the urban is catching drawings that i make i think it will be quite interesting to make a video about that about how i draw in the street or even by photos so yeah and that's it um i will probably appear more from now on um i'm very excited of what i'm going to bring to you guys